guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Jean Emma Pola. If you're new here, hello, welcome. And today I'm going to be doing a fall try on haul. This is like my favorite video I do every single year. It is like the video I look forward to every single year. I have been collecting pieces from multiple random different stores, online boutiques, that sort of thing. Of course, let me know what your favorite thing is that I picked up and let's just make this intro short. First store I'm going to talk about is Forever 21. I did something with a company called Magic Links through Forever 21, so they let me pick out a certain amount of pieces of items through a special link that they sent me. So a lot of these pieces are fall related, but a lot of them are not fall related at all. Like they're just kind of like dresses and things for like going out, going to events. So I'm going to be showing you guys all those, but let's jump into it. The first thing I got is this off the shoulder top. It's a black one. It's very, very stretchy. I got this in the size small and this was $14.90. I think this is so cute. This is going to look great with high-waisted jeans, black over-the-knee boots. I'm living for it. I'm about it. Yes. Next thing I got is another off-the-shoulder top. It is this beige one right here. Very stretchy. has this, like, fold-over thing right here, which I love that detail. Long sleeve. Very comfy. Very warm. And this was a size small, and this was $19.90, and I cannot wait to style this. Next thing I got is a bodysuit. It is this kind of mauve shade, beige mauve shade. I got this also in a size small. This was $10.90. My only complaint with this one is it's not like a thong. <laughs> It doesn't have like a thong bottom, so I'm like, how the heck do you wear this? Like, I, I don't want underwear lines, so I'm kind of like questioning why I got this or whatever, but it's still so cute, but it's like, I, I don't know, like, is this going to show through and like look like I have a diaper on, you know, <laughs> you know what I mean? Still cute, and I've been a big fan of bodysuits. I'm wearing one right now, big fan of that, so still okay with getting this. Next thing I got is a tight bodycon type of dress. It's long sleeve, but plot twist, it has an attached choker to it. This trend has been around for a while. This trend was a thing last year. I never jumped on that trend until this year. So pretty happy I finally picked this up because I think it's super sexy, but also kind of classy at the same time. And it's going to be really great for the fall time with over the knee boots. This was a size small and this was $14.90. Next thing I got is very different. It kind of reminds me of Pocahontas, but I'm still kind of living for it. This brown dress off the shoulder and it kind of looks like this. It is a little bit tighter, but I don't know, it kind of gives me that poke honest vibes, you know what I mean? What I do appreciate about it is it has this rubber like jelly thing at the top so it doesn't slide down. This was size small and $17.90. And again, when I say size small, it's not to brag, it's to give you a reference so you guys can know what size might work for you in comparison to my body. I don't want you guys thinking I'm like bragging. Okay, this is probably the most folly thing of, out of all of this is this sweater right here. Now this has the cutout right here and the choker trend as well. It's this burgundy dark like plumish color. I think it is so cute and I love how like it's very thick material, great quality. This is $17.90. This is just gonna be really cute with jeans and like some beige riding boots. Uh, I cannot wait to use this. Texas would get itself together and stop being so hot. Next thing I got is kind of a set. It is this one right here. It has this kind of um, crisscross detail in the front and then it's completely sheer mesh in the back. This is a size small. I almost wish I got an extra small because yeah girl, she's lacking a little bit in the top region. So I wish I got this an extra small, but I got this in small. This was $19.90. This is the top. I do feel like the padding is very, very cheap. This almost feels like something I would get on like sheinsideronway.com. Whatever, still works, really cute. And the bottom, big fan of the bottom. The bottoms look like this. It's kind of that ruffled ruche kind of detail as a zipper in the back. This was $24.90, which I feel like this is pretty expensive for a skirt. So I don't know. I'm not really a big fan of the price point on that one, but very, very cute and makes the booty look good if you know what I'm saying. All right, again, the next thing that isn't completely fall related is this dress right here, a bodycon kind of dress. Kind of like cups your boobies, um, cinches in at the waist. I don't really know what to say about it. It's just like a plain black dress, but it's great for just, you know, that little black dress that every girl gotta have in their closet. And this was $22.90 and I got this in a size small. Ah, I'm dropping things. Next thing I got, which can definitely be worn in the fall time, is this black shirt. This is very similar to the dress I showed you. So same thing, off the shoulder, long sleeve black shirt. Has the choker trend attached to it. This was $19.90. And I do feel like the sleeves are a little long on it, but you know what? I'll survive. It's still great. Next thing I got is this beige dress right here, which has the crisscross detail in the front. 
It does fit your boobs a little weird. I don't really know where to position this on my boobies, but I think this is so great and flattering. I like the color. This was $19.90. Next thing I got is a white hoodie. It's pretty thin material, but it's still kind of cute and trendy. And I don't know if you're feeling kind of lazy that day or bummy, you want to throw something on that's basic and plain, then this is the sweater for you. <laughs> I like it a lot. And I got this in a size small. I almost wish I kind of got this in an extra small. And this was $14.90. Four more things left, guys. I got, again, another black bodycon dress. This one's cool. It has this really cool tie-up detail on the back. This was $17.90 and it fits really well. It's very flattering. I really like it. This could be kind of cool to like throw a jean jacket over it and some over the knee boots. Me likey. <laughs> Next thing I got is a little out of the ordinary for me. I'm not really one to kind of um, wear like totally like edgy kind of different things. And maybe I'm just ridiculous for thinking this is totally out of the box because it's maybe not. But I got this um, jean jacket that looks like this. Has this like, I don't even know, crisscross ribbon detail? This kind of reminds me of something Tana Mojo would wear. Like, correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like this is something Tana would wear. I still really like it. I'm going to try and figure out how to style this. This was $22.90. Very good quality. A little big. So I almost, again, wish I got this in an extra small. I can see myself wearing this in, like, New York or something. Two more things left. I got another bodycon dress. Black, per usual. I should step out of my comfort zone a little bit, but whatever. Um, this is this one's really cool because it looks similar to the other one I got, but these are on the side, the lace-up detail on the side. And then it's thick-strapped, and it's very flattering on my top which is why I really like it okay that was everything from forever 21 thank you magic links for sending those to me and now we're gonna move on to my favorite thing you're probably thinking I'm gonna say Nordstrom, but no, I actually refrain from Nordstrom in this haul for the most part. Uh, my favorite online boutique or shop is lulus.com, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got because I got sent some great things. I absolutely love Lulu's. Their clothes is extremely high quality. I feel like they have pretty good prices and they ship fast and they just have the cutest stuff. So they did send me things. Thank you, Lulu's. I love you guys. And let's just get right into it. I'm gonna start off with some shoes. First off, I got these shoes. I don't know how to explain these. I guess like they're like loafers. I got these in a six and a half, and I really, really wish I got these in a seven because they're pretty tight on my feet. So I do feel like you may, you may need a size up for these. But I think they're super, super cute, and I just feel like they can kind of tie any outfit together. Love these. Next thing I got is some white denim jeans, and I have been looking for some good quality white denim jeans for a while. I know it's after Labor Day, you probably can't wear these, but who cares? Breaking the rules here. These do have the cutouts at the knees, which I really like, and has a little frayed bottom, so those are pretty cute. They are very low rise, they're not high waisted, which I kind of wish they were high waisted, but that's okay. I got these in a size 25, I almost feel like I could have got these one size down, so I do feel like their jeans run a little bit bigger, so you probably could size down on those as well, one half size or full size. Next thing I got is a beige sweater, and it has this cute little like mini little cutouts in the front and back. Quality again feels so incredibly soft and great and like something you would find at Nordstrom so I really really like this. Black and white flannel and it has a little bit of navy in it and I think it's so cute. It's very soft again great quality. I got this in a size small. Love. Next thing I got is a blue sweater and this has this crisscross in the back. Love that. Again quality feels incredible. I got this in a size extra small and that was a pretty good size for me so Thumbs up for that one. Okay, the next thing I got is a sweater dress. I think that's what you call it. It has like a high neck on it and then these cutouts on the arms and it's just black. Again, very cute. This would be really great with like a suede jacket, which I got one of those. Like a suede ja jacket, riding boots or over the knee boots. And I also got this in a small. Well, since I showed you guys this already, I got a suede jacket. I've been wanting one of these forever, since like two years ago. And I had this one that I loved at Nordstrom. It was too expensive. I couldn't make myself buy it. So this is the one I got. I got this in the size small. It fits me really, really well. Again, the quality is great. And before I go any further, I want to mention that I'm going to have everything linked down below. <clears throat> wow, that was cute. Excuse me. <laughs> if it's not linked down below, it's probably because I can't find it online anymore. But I'll try my best to have everything linked for you guys. Next thing from Lulu's is this black top. It has the crisscross tie detail on the front and then a collar at the top. It's very thin material, kind of sheer, very like loose hangy, but it still feels like good quality. I got this in an extra small. I probably feel like I could have got this in a small and would have looked a little bit better, but again, I will still wear it and I like the pocket in the front. Next thing I got was a little bit random, but I just thought it was so pretty. I got this velvet dress. It's like a burgundy plum velvet dress with a deep cut. It has this like um, rubber thing at the front here so it doesn't slip off your boobie, which is great. I 
I got this in a size small and it, it does fit my boobs a little bit loose because I don't have big boobs. Hopefully I can find a place to wear this. Random accessory that I got are these glasses and I love these. I love these. Like, <laughs> these glasses make me so excited. They're from the brand Les Specs or Lee Specs. I'm not really sure how you pronounce that. I think it's Les Specs though. And great quality. I love just, look at them. They're so fun. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm psycho. I just love these. Okay, I'm done talking about it. Next thing I got is a pair of jeans. These are high-waisted. They are from this brand right here. I think it's called a Goldie. I got these in a size 25. Definitely could have sized down to a 24. These do run a little bit big. They're very stretchy also. So do size down in these. They're high-waisted. They make the booty look good. They're kind of cropped, so they're not going to go all the way down to your feet. Um, so I do kind of like that because I don't have any pairs like these. I love dark wash jeans. That is like my thing is dark wash jeans. Again, quality feels great. So two more things from Lulu. The next thing I got is a jean jacket. It has kind of distressed things on it, which I don't mind at all. I kind of like that effect and that detail. Got this in a size small. This is just going to be great with black jeans, white v-neck, converse, that sort of thing. Last thing, I am so excited about this. I have wanted over-the-knee boots that like fit my thighs well for the longest time, and I freaking found them. I could not ever bring myself to pay for the Stuart Weitzman boots. Those are like six to eight hundred dollars, something ridiculous. Lulu's had the hookup. Really like these. The material does feel a little bit cheap because it's not like real, real suede or leather or whatever. But I don't mind it at all because it's still very good quality and they're great. They're affordable. So if you're looking for over-the-knee black boots this fall or winter, here you go. Okay, so the next place we're going to be hauling is ShopToby.com. And again, this company sent me stuff, so thank you, ShopToby. I do really, really like ShopToby. I feel like they have some great stuff. But however, I feel like whether it's my body. Body, I'm not really sure it just doesn't fit the greatest so for example this top which I think is so cute has the choker detail and the cutout it's just too low around my boobs so I have to wear like a bralette but even then I feel like it just dips too low and I don't I'm not really a fan of like you know revealing my boobies too much so it's kind of hard for me to figure out how to wear this however the quality is really nice it is thin but it's very nice very very soft and I got this in a size extra small next thing I really like black dresses can you tell I got a black dress again this is a strapless one kind of a body hugging dress this is super cute very flattering really like this dress and I got this in a small next thing I'm a big fan of but again it does fit me very well is this black romper I love the sleeves I love that like mesh lacy detail on it and the bell sleeves I got a lot of compliments on this because I wore this last night to an event it's great however again just does not fit me well on my chest at all I literally had to get fashion tape and like stick it down because it just was like flying open so I don't know if I need bigger boobs or if it just I don't know if it just doesn't fit well but I got a small on this it's very cute still will wear it I just have to use fashion tape with it next thing that I got is this black off the shoulder top and this is very good quality has these cute little bell sleeves kind of like overlaps in the front front of your boobies I really really like this this will be really nice for an event high-waisted skirt or jeans whatever so I really like this top it's really elegant and classy next thing is this bodysuit and this does not fit me well either unfortunately it's just it's too loose and I guess I would have to use fashion tape with this too but it just doesn't fit me very well it falls off very easily and looks a little too slumpy on me so I don't know if I needed a different size not sure it's still so cute but it just doesn't fit me very well I got that in a size small the next thing I got is a denim skirt and it's very very cute I'm kind of into the denim skirt trend but again this doesn't fit me very well um, it's super weird because it's very tight at the band and I'm like struggling to get it over my booty and my thighs then once it's on it just doesn't fit well doesn't fit my waist well doesn't fit my butt well so you guys can kind of see it's so cute but it just doesn't fit me well and I got this in a size small next thing I got is this blush sweater right here very good quality very thick very warm love it love the back it goes all the way down and does this does this lace-up detail on the back really really like that this is something I will 100% wear got this in a size small no complaints here with this one the last thing I got is this snake print romper this is so unbelievably cute. I love it. However, it doesn't fit me well in the front again. So this is something I'd have to use fashion tape with. The button on the back broke, but they did give me an extra button. So that's good. I'll have to just sew a new button on. Got this in a size small. Probably could have gotten an extra small. I still really like it. So that is everything from Shop Toby. Thank you, Shop Toby, for sending me stuff. And again, those will all be listed down below for you guys.
Okay, so moving on to some random accessories. I have purses, shoes, scarves to show you guys, and then this haul is over. So first thing that I got is a scarf off of Amazon, this plaid one right here. I think it's so beautiful. The quality is great. Very inexpensive. Got this off of Amazon, so I'll have this listed down below. This is just going to be great for like, you know, those typical fall outfits, and I just love it. Next one I got is this one right here, so more of a dark burgundy one. And this is just going to be great again for fall because there's so many different colors you can pull from this scarf to really make it like a really cohesive, cute little outfit. Like you could wear burgundies, yellows, oranges, greens to really tie the outfit together. So love this. Again, great quality. These are awesome and I might be giving away one of these eventually, so stay tuned. Okay, so these are the only things I got from Nordstrom in this haul. You guys should be really proud of me. Normally I'm like a Nordstrom hog. This time I didn't go crazy, so a round of applause for me. First thing I got from Nordstrom are these blush shoes. These are some slip-ons with kind of these like holy mesh details on them, but they're super cute. Very, very comfy. I got these in a size six and a half and these were, I think, pretty affordable. I have them listed down below, but a lot of you guys were asking me where I got these from on Insta Stories and Nordstrom and the brand is Caslon. Next thing I got are some like lifestyle shoes, I guess you could call them, that's what they call them on Nike.com. These beige ones, these beige little Nike shoes. I got these for about 70-ish dollars. I had a $100 gift card, so I got these for free, which was really nice. Very comfy. These are going to be great for just walking around, pairing with a lot of like neutrals, because I don't own any Nikes like this, and these aren't for working out. These are just for walking around. Casual little outfits, so I thought these were really fun to pick up. And the final and last thing in this haul are purses. So first off, I got two purses in a wallet from this company called Dagny Dover. I've worked with Dagny Dover for years. I have loved this company. I own so many of their bags. Big fan. Support them. First thing I got is this wallet from Dagny Dover, this beige kind of tan color. Uh, has these compartments that kind of expand so you can fit quite a bit in here in a com compartment in the back very high quality and has a magnet in the front super cute very small compact so you can fit in any bag next thing I got y'all I I just love it I love it so much a snake skin over the shoulder bag so it opens up like this has many compartments again, has a compartment in the back. I got it trashed up already since I've been using it a lot, but it's so cute and has a magnet in the front. And then I feel like this can just go well with a lot of outfits, so. Last item in this haul is a tote or a big bag. It is this burgundy one, which I think is absolutely beautiful. You can fit so much in here. This is gonna be great for traveling. All their bags are super organized. So like if you have a 13 inch laptop, it comes built in with a case for that. And then it has like a phone carrier, water bottle carrier section, place for your pens, your cards. Like there's so much room for activities in this thing. So I really, really like these bags. This will be really great for traveling and just throwing a bunch of stuff in it and keeping yourself organized. Thank you so much, Dagny Dover. Love you guys, love your bags. I'll have those linked down below for you as well. So we made it to the end of this haul. Let me know again, as always, if you made it to the end of this haul and let me know what are your favorite pieces that I picked up and are you going to buy them yourself? And make sure you check out my vlog channel. I've been posting very consistently on there. So check out my vlogs, it's Janine TV, and all my social media is Janine Amapola. I interact with you guys very, very often. And I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys soon next Saturday. Peace out, Girl Scout. Bye, guys. Before I go, I wanted to remind you guys to check out my last video that I did with cotton where I stepped out of my comfort zone and tried something for the first time. It was pretty scary. And you guys can find out where I got <laughs> these pieces from because you can find it in my collection that I made with cotton. It'll be linked down below as well as my previous video. So I hope you guys will check that out. And thank you so much to cotton for working with me on this video. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace out, Girl Scout. Bye.